I've been off for so long. I tried to do a little live yesterday on my dog channel just to kind of see um, what that was going to be like because I've never done anything like that before. And it was very intimidating. I definitely think that um, being able to interact with people, I like that idea. Um, so it was kind of fun and I wanted to try it out on my beauty TikTok, but didn't have enough followers. So here I am. I'm taking my beauty sponge and just blending everything out. I've been kind of doing my makeup the same every day. Um, just like a natural look. Sometimes I add, you know, a little bit extra here and there. But I'm just going to show you what I've been doing every day. This looks a little bit light. But once I get my bronzer and stuff on, it's going to be okay. I have been so overwhelmed. Or not overwhelmed, but just when I do something, I give like 150%. So... Um, that's why you guys don't see me for a while is just that I'm focused on other things in my life. Um, but I realized that I need to start doing things for me and things that I enjoy instead of like throwing myself into things that, yes, it's good to do that, but I need to take some time out for myself. So I'm going to be using the NARS Laguna. I'm almost out of this. I need to get a new one. I love this. Um, I have oily skin and it seems like a cream product and usually cream products don't work well with oily skin but for some reason this just works. It just works. really like the color of it and it's not too dark. It's kind of like a, I think it would work well for anyone with light, medium, light to medium skin. Sorry about the dog snoring. It is what it is. I have dog snoring from this direction and this direction. I'm so used to it though, I, I wouldn't even notice it, but I always get asked on my videos about it. Okay, so um, now I'm going to go ahead and just fill in my eyebrows a little bit. I'm using... I've, I've tried out different eyebrow things, but I just always go back to this dip brow pomade and taupe. And I had this in the car, so it's pretty cold. It's actually been super cold here lately. I'm talking like 20 degrees outside. It's been super sunny, and like it looks like it's going to be nice and warm, but you step outside and it's like bone chilling cold. So usually I'm doing my makeup on my way to work. Or finishing up with it so products work a lot better when they're like room temperature so yeah I'm not liking the cold at all I'm so ready for summer you guys spring summer please it can't get here fast enough So I'm just going to take my spoolie and fluff my eyebrows out a little bit. Honestly, I don't care if they're a little bit messy. I don't really do like the sharp eyebrow look anymore. It's kind of like just fill them in and comb them out. And if they're a little messy, that's okay. Okay, now I'm going to move on to my eyes. I've been using this for such a long time now. It's the Art Thera Peachy Pro Longwear Paint Pot. It's just a really pretty peachy shade. And I just put this all over the lid and blend it out. And sometimes I just use this and that's it. And then other times I'll use another paint pot. This is called groundwork and it's just like a brown a medium brown <clears throat> I don't know what's going on with my voice <clears throat> so let's see I'm just gonna use um, any old brush this is like a liner brush but I'm just gonna put this underneath my lower lash line And 
then in the outer corner. And just kind of blend that in to the crease. So what's new with you guys? I feel like the world has changed so much drastically. Okay, now I am going to take a little bit of concealer to clean that up. This is the Tarte Shape Tape in Light Sand. This might be a tad light. And just kind of clean up the outer edge. And then um, the inner corner, just kind of blend that out. I always get like darker in this area right here. So I like to go there and kind of just leave this area with less makeup because it can make that area look a little more wrinkly with more product. I just made an appointment for lip injections again. I haven't done it since like September. But I really want to get that done again. Okay, so um, I'm just going to be doing like one syringe like I always do. And I, I feel like my lips aren't as plump but they are, but you get used to that. Like you get used to them being plump. So you think your lips are small, but they're really not. I just really have to pay attention to that so I don't go overboard. I'm using this Anastasia Italian Summer Palette. I love this palette, it's so pretty. It has a really pretty peachy shade. Love this for a blush. It's like a peach with, um, I don't know what it reminds me of. It reminds me of like cantaloupe or a color like that from MAC. It's just like a light peachy, beautiful color. And I'm working really quickly because I have work today. So I just kind of wanted to do a really quick video since I told you I was, told you that I was going to do a video. Um, this is Laura Mercier's Highlight 01. Okay, so I have just applied my liner. This is the Wet n Wild Breakup Proof Waterproof Eyeliner. This is really good. I've, I've purchased so many of these and I have backups on hand because it's matte and it glides on so smooth. And it's like a, has hairs. They're probably synthetic hairs, but like a brush type tip, not like a felt tip. So I really like that. Um, now I'm going to take a little bit of this MAC Vanilla Pigment in Vanilla. MAC, did I already say that? Oh my gosh, I'm losing it. Okay, so I have this little tiny brush that I like to use. And actually I need to wet my brush. I need something. Oh, I know I have some Fix Plus. Okay, good. I do have a little tiny... Fix Plus from MAC. And I just need something to make that pigment stick a little bit. So I'm putting this on the inner corner. This is so pretty. I've had this for so long and it still looks like the pigment is at the very top. So a little bit goes a long way and it lasts forever. don't want too much just kind of like a natural pop and I guess I'm going to take some on the lid too just right in the center okay now I'm just going to curl my eyelashes and add a little mascara I'm using the Lash Princess well, False Lash Effect Mascara. I'm 
gonna do one layer and then after it dries for a second I'm gonna come back and do another layer okay so I have this this is a an NC 15 and W20 it's a studio I can't even read it anymore chromographic pencil I'm gonna put this on my lower waterline this just really brightens up I should, should have shown you the difference but it really like brightens up and opens your eyes I'm gonna go back and add a little more mascara Oh, and I got these, um, I've always really liked these Sephora cream lip stains. These are really good, you guys. They're very inexpensive, and they have just about every color that you could imagine. I'm going to be using number 68. It dries down to like a matte finish, but it doesn't dry out your lips, or at least it doesn't dry out my lips. It still feels really comfortable and lasts all day. I do add a little bit of gloss just because with this and then a little bit of gloss, it just makes your lips look so plump and juicy. I am actually running out of this. I really like this too. It's the e.l.f. Lip Lacquer in Wild Rose. This is such a pretty gloss. It's a very like creamy, milky looking pink. So once that dries, I just add a little bit and it just gives a little bit of a shine. This lip cream does look a little bit like, not shiny, but it has a little bit of a glow to it. It dries down matte, but it has like a sheen. And then this just adds a little bit more of a wet look. So it's really pretty. Okay, um, sometimes I will go in and add a little bit of the bronzer on my eyes which brush do I want to use okay let's do this one just in the outer corner and then blend it I'm already doing a summer look and it's not even summer yet that's how much I want it to be summer And I'm adding a little bit of mascara. See you guys, this look was so easy and it's so pretty. I think this is a good work look or even like a day date or anything like that. So pretty. Um, so that's it. That's it for my video. I wish I could have done a live today so that I can interact with you guys, but that will be soon. Um, I don't know how I'm going to get that many subscribers on TikTok because I don't have a lot of beauty content on there, but I guess I'm going to have to start um, uploading some more TikToks on that channel or I don't know what I'm saying. It's early guys. I hope you guys have a good Thursday and I will see you guys soon. Bye.